Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome to Summer in Mara. Uh, this one's been uh, tickling under the radar for a little while now. A few people on our Discord have been talking about it. Um, and I think it could be an interesting one. I think it may well become a new one that we can start putting into the live stream rotation alongside Animal Crossing. Uh, for those of you wondering, it is a sort of Animal Crossing live sim style game. Maybe a little bit more akin to something like Stardew Valley. Uh, I think quite similar to something like My Time at Porsche that we played on the channel way back. And I know a lot of you really enjoyed that one. Very cute game. Very chilled game. Building up a little farm, uh, exploring a town. We're going to see. I do think it'll work well as a live stream game, but we're going to do at least episode one here as a regular Let's Play, just to kind of get an idea of what's going on. we got a be- oh, Christ! <laughs> I, was say, I was just about to say, we've got a beautiful sight here, but there's just a ship being blown up. Oh, and this lady uh, has found a little baby, and I'm, I think we play the baby. I think is the idea. So we're an orphan. Wow, this is a, this is hitting me right in the feels before we've even started. Uh, okay, that's that's the intro, and there we are, a, a kid. Okay, so we can zoom. We can okay, right click. So E is to sit. Okay. Okay, there we can. Oh, okay. There, oh, now we can move around. Okay, so here we go. This is our little farm. And this is, uh, oh, this is the lady who saved us before. Let's have a look. Koa, were you on the roof again? No, yeah, yeah. Telling lies, no, papa. Uh, I just saw you coming down. Isn't there work to do? Changing the subject. On the island, there's always work to do. Uh, we need oranges to make juice for breakfast. I'm too old to get them myself. Oranges for the lady coming right up. Collect three oranges to make juice for breakfast. Let's go. Oranges. Are not grown in the ground. Oranges are on a plant, uh, on a tree. Where can we? Where can we find orange? It's not given. This is a very pretty game. I love this kind of art style, like low poly, but with like painted textures. I'm kind of into it. This this looks like there's uh, oranges. That I think I just picked up an orange. Okay, so is there any more trees like that around? Yes, there's a little one over here. Look. Let's give this tree a boot. Boof. And again, maybe? No, just the one orange there. Maybe over here? If not this one, I can see one over there. But this looks like an orange tree. Boom. There's me three oranges. We can go back and we can have some breakfast juice. I love a nice bit of orange juice at breakfast. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Have the most beautiful oranges on the island. They're a bit bruised because they literally just fell on the floor. I, I just smacked the tree. Juice is delicious. Now I feel energized. Awesome. I love the I love the art style of these characters as well. Uh, remember this color. You can win anyone's heart with food. This is true, especially mine. Now you have to prepare a new crop field. Okay, I'll watch how you do it from here. No, no. You're clearly a young, quite a young adult. You can do it yourself. Pick up a hoe and prepare the fields. You'll be able to plant those carrot seeds afterwards. To finish, get water from the well and pour it over them. Will I have to shower afterwards? You will if you get muddy. Yeah, yeah, I'm always muddy. This is true. Okay, so you have orange, I get carrots in return, and we can now make orange juice, and we've got a hoe. Power crop field to grow carrots using the hoe. Okay, so... We can feed that thing corn. Uh, there's a... Select the hoe. Oh, here we go. Scroll wheel. Uh, prepare. We carrot seeds plants. Good. Get water from the well. Here it is over here. Oh. So we just have to run over them with the bucket. That's good. I think he's ready, ma'am. Right. Now we need to collect some firewood, but I lost my old axe. I have to make a new one. Can I do it? Sure, why not? All you need is a stone and a bit of wood. Great, I'll have my very own axe. Is it interesting now that's kind of become standard in games? Like, one stone, one twig makes an axe. Like, in real life, can you imagine just getting, a, like, a stone and a twig? Wouldn't do anything. We'll meet afterwards beside the old tree. Okay, are we? Oh, we've been given the stone and the axe. Okay, uh, we now make a new one in the house. Let's go and see our little house. Oh, cool. Okay, so tools, I guess. Axe requires three wood and a stone, which we have. Accept. 
I have to be careful with this axe. It's very sharp. Is it? Because it looked like a bit of stone and some wood. So... Can we chop down any tree? Or should we go and speak to the blue lady? I feel like we should go and speak to the blue lady. Ooh. Oh, we can jump really high. Uh, look at this axe. Good. Now he has to cut down this tree. Oh, I feel sorry for it. I feel sorry for it too. But what we take from nature must be given back. We live in Mara. Life flows through this big ocean surrounding us. If we take advantage of nature, it's our duty to compensate for the things we took. We are part of this cycle. Koa, none of the things you see are yours. Mara lent them to us. I like it. Should I cut down the tree now? What do you say? Thank you, tree. Take a seed. When you're finished cutting down the tree, go plant the seeds somewhere on the island. That's an equal exchange. Is it? Is it cutting down a whole tree and then putting down a seed to be like, yeah, 20 years there'll be another tree here. So three hits. Boom. We got ourselves a, a pot and some wood. Okay, so how do we... Let's plant a pine nut. Find flat terrain. Where's the flat terrain? This looks pretty flat. Okay. Do you have to do much about that, or do you think that'll just sort of grow? <laughs> Trees now planted. I hope it grows very tall. If you take good care of it, I'm sure it'll become gigantic. Uh, I will water it every day. Yeah, yeah. All right, Koa. Uh, do you want to learn your recipe? You'll make an orange jam. Oh, nice. That's marmalade, though, right? Very easy recipe. Go to the kitchen at home and prepare some. Orange jam. What well, the difference between orange jam and marmalade is? I'm not a fan of either, though, to be fair. I had a phase where I was a big fan of marmalade. Like about a, about six months where I was really into marmalade and toast. Kitchen, I guess, orange jam is. Yeah. Um, oh, we need some more oranges. Okay, there's one orange. So I'm assuming these orange trees grow once a day, maybe? Oh, we can't use that. That's fine. I don't want to use it anyway. just wanted oranges. There's another well there. Let's hit this one. Should be an orange in there. Yep, yeah, good. Did you say three oranges, I think? Let's get this one as well then. And that pine nut is not going away. The little logo there. I'm going to suggest that we have to water it using this. Are we saying that little sim that little bit of smoky mist means we're watered? I'm gonna say so. We've now watered our pine nuts. We've got fruit and veg here as well, a lot to dig up. So what's that? That was four before. It's still four. I wonder if that's four days. Would make sense, I suppose. Make ourselves some lovely orange jam. I'm going to bring Yaya some of it. Come on then. It's gonna take Yaya some jam. I don't know why she keeps moving further away. For no particular reason. Whee! That's a jump and a half, that is. Oh, we're going to learn to fish. Try the jam. Oh, we're going to have fish for dinner? Depends on whether we're not take the bait. We will see. What about cooking yummy fish? Listen to the recipe, Koa. You'll need a fish, red tail, catfish. And then you chop some carrots. Why do pirates never come here? And then we add, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do pirates never come here? What? Were you paying attention to me? I can see them from the mountain. They're always far away and they never come here. Maybe because there's nothing here that they are interested in. It's a tiny island. But we have the door and the fountain, Neo and Neo. The island is very beautiful. That's true. We're not taking care of it for others. We take care of it, the island, because it's important to maintain it. Although I sometimes leave, I always come back because of you and our house. And even when I'm gone, I never stop thinking about the island. Our home reflects what we think of ourselves. We have to love ourselves, right? Right. Well, what were we talking about? About dinner. Yes, but what was I saying? Never mind. It's getting late, Koa. I need fuel for the boat. Fill the tank and bring it to the dock. Of course, Lady Haku. We have an old tank to fill up. This is a very wholesome game, by the way. A resin float looks like a kebab. Collect fuel from the Guardian's Door Fountain and bring it to Yaya Haku. What's the Guardian's Door Fountain? It sounds incredible. 
Let's go. Unless it's... I mean, is that it? No, that's just like a pond, right? Is it like a map? The Guardian's Door Fountain. Uh, it sounds like the sort... Sounds like the sort of thing that would be up and, you know, it sounds like something that's prominent and high up. There is a door, look. I'm going to say the fountain's up here. Nope. Ah, is that the fountain? Yes, I just saw the flashy thing there then. The fountain is by the side of the door. Now, I can't imagine we had to drop through there, so I wonder if it's a case of going through the little cave that was at the bottom of this one. Very pretty little game. I think it still needs a little polish. It needs a few shaders thrown on it, you know, that kind of thing. But, uh, yeah, really nice looking game. Oh, we've got... I wonder if we can... There used to be bats in this cave, but there are none left. We can break that with a better hammer. That's cool. So that's where we get some iron ore. And then we have this awesome, mysterious door down the bottom here. I wonder what that's all about. Take care of the door. Don't mess with the door. Blah, blah, the door. Let's fill up the old tank. I fill the tank. This is a good way of getting to see all the, the island space, right? See what we've got to work with. I know you can get a boat. This isn't the, the only space we've got. I know you can go out on the boat yourself. And explore and stuff and find new islands and and things like that. But other than that, I don't really, I'm kind of coming to this blind, to be honest. I'm kind of coming into this one blind. Here she is on the old boaty. Have a safe journey, are you? Remember what I asked for? What did you ask for? Chocolate! If you want to stay, I could take the boat to buy it. In a few years, maybe you can visit the city with me. See, it's very dangerous. You should never sail alone. What about you? Actually, it's okay. I'll let you sail alone. Oh, I've got a really horrible feeling that this isn't going to end well. I've got a really horrible feeling that, that might be the last time we ever see her. Let's see. First, I need to catch a fish. Yeah, yeah, I took a fishing rod with that. I'm going to have to make one myself at the workshop. I just need some materials. Okay. Uh, make a fishing rod at the workshop. Go says to catch a red tailfish. Let's go and see what we need to make a fishing rod. We, I'm going to say wood. And uh, maybe that's it. I don't know. Workshop. Resin float. Resin and wood. No, we don't want to make that. We want to make wooden rod. A resin, oh, we do need a resin float and wood. Okay, so where are we getting resin from? Where are we getting resin from? Resin is like a tree thing, I suppose. You used to get that resin from the bark of a tree. I wonder if... if um... Oh, I've got the hoe. Sorry, there we go. I wonder if, like, uh, if it's just a random drop from trees as well as wood. Like, what's that thing there? Take. Resin. Oh, there we go. We've got two resin now. So we should have what we need to make uh, to make this stuff then. I'm going to get a bit more wood. Because I feel like we're going to use wood for the float and wood for the... There we go. Yeah, that's resin. That's wood. Okay, cool. Uh, one more tree. Let's just not... I'm not going to... What are you about chocolate for, lady? Yeah, one more treat. Just to make sure we've got the stuff. I'm not going to go crazy, though. I'm not treating this like an Animal Crossing Nook Miles Island. I'm not wiping the place out. I'm just going to get enough to make what we need. A resin float. Except. So we've made one of those. And with that, we can make a wooden rod... I hope these don't break. I'm not a huge fan of durability in tools. Fish, some carrots. Hmm, I didn't listen to the rest of it. Well, never mind. It'll work. Yummy fish. Yummy fish, question mark. We need a red tail catfish and we need some carrots. Well, we have carrots. Uh, we can harvest those carrots. And we we, just, we got some carrots, did we? Now, do we we need seeds to replant? I guess it's not. We're not getting any seeds from the veg, so perhaps we have to buy the seeds. Is there a way to see our inventory? 
Uh, inventory is I. There we go. So we have carrots, orange jam, vegetables, carrots, corn, lettuce. So what's the difference between... Oh, so we can't eat lettuce, but we can eat carrots. Woodstone, resin, nothing from the sea, no special items. Okay. So we didn't pick up the odd seed from there. Looks like we're going to have to buy seeds. But we can now come down here to fish, perhaps. Here's the fishing spot. Oh, we can take some worms. Okay. Press the button when the indicator's green. Okay, it's in between those two things. That's good. Oh, we have to press the button. Follow the fish. Oh, okay. So we're using, we're using A and D to to do that. Awesome. That's pretty neat. Big fan of a fish mini game, honestly. Love to see different uh, different mechanics there. Oh, that was a bit quick there. I got some trash. Should we try that again? Go fishing. So A and D. D. There we go. And we've got to get that bar, top bar down before that bottom bar goes down, I guess. There we go. Oh, that's quite a cool little way of doing fishing. I like that. I'm always interested to see how games tackle fishing. These games always have it. It's standard, isn't it, right? You make an axe, you go fishing. You're good to go. But uh, we should have what we need now for making a yummy fish. It doesn't look yummy. This doesn't look right. No, it doesn't. I hope it's still edible. Oh, no. It gets too dark. Yeah, you won't be able to get back. I must light the fire atop the mountain so you can guide her. Just need a torch. That's easy. Uh, some wood should be enough. Okay. So. Is that a tool? Yeah, torch is wood. Go. Well, must be careful. Fire is dangerous. Ah, it's getting dark. Now it's time to light the fire atop the mountain. Good thing I remembered. Well, aren't you responsible, Koa? Okay, so... Okay, it hasn't uh, it hasn't given me the torch as an actual sort of tool to hold. Look at all the animals asleep, bless them. But I do see a little thing here. So I'm assuming we're going to start at this one and then move our way up. There we go. And I wonder if it's... These are on timers, look. So let's do these as we go, I guess. I don't know whether we're expected to do all of them in one go, or however far we get is how far we get, right? So if we do to that, we're going to get another one, look. But we can now go from there and carry on up, right? Okay, that's good. Oh, we might, might have been able to do that in one go if I was hurry. I think I can see Aya. I'm glad she arrived safe and sound. I hope she bought my chocolate. There she Oh, she's back. I was good. I was a little worried. Can I just sit there? Can I and chill? Ah. Oh. Okay, let's go down and hope she got some chocolate. Kind of going to be fuming if she hasn't, to be honest. Kind of going to be fuming. If she hasn't got my choc choc. Here we go. Not a fan of chocolate, to be honest. I'd rather chips. Much rather, I'm a savoury guy. How about yourself? Let me know in the comments. Let's do that YouTuber thing where I pretend I care about something to get people to comment on things. Uh, yeah, sour cream or uh, or all dressed. I'm pretty into. Or is that what they're called? All dressed. Did you bring chocolate? I forgot. For fuck. I, just, I asked you for one thing, yeah, yeah. If I knew that, I wouldn't have cooked dinner. Did you cook dinner? Yes, that fish recipe. It's not very good. I wasn't inspired. It's okay. Sorry, yeah, yeah. Don't worry, Koa. This is your first time. It's normal. Talent has to be nurtured. Practice what it makes. And not being afraid of failing and being wrong. Make dinner tomorrow. And the day after, and the day after that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't give me all the chores until you get it right. Don't run away from your mistakes. Next time we'll be better. That's it. Come to the Guardian's door. Why? I want to tell you something. But first, take this key and go to the uh, crystallist sphere I keep in my chest. You never let me look in your chest. Today is different. We'll meet at the door. Mm. What's going on, Yaya? So her chest was down by the uh, the front of the house, I think. Because I'm pretty sure it was the thing that said, keep away from this chest. 
There's the chrysalis. The chest is full of trinkets of mine. Lots of letters and papers. Haku keeps everything. Uh, but not a single treasure. I'm going to bring Yaya the chrysalis. Meet Haku. So who's Yaya? Hold on. You're Haku? So who's Yaya then? I'm completely losing track of, of who everyone is. My name is Moa. Well, no, my name is John C. The character's name is Moa, I think. Is that right? So we're going to head down here. And let's see what let's see what it says when they talk. One of them is like the god of the island, right? The spirit of the island, I suppose. So I'm Koa. What did you want to tell me, Yaya? Yaya Haku. Oh, so it's like... It's like Grandma Haku, I understand. So Yaya is like Nanny. Do you remember the story about the Guardians? Yes. They protected the sea and the door. That's it. Whenever there was any danger, they met here and opened the door with the four chrysalis. Will you open the door at some point? Only when Mara is truly threatened. So Mara is the, the god, the, the, the island. It will open when the four chrysalis are placed here as if they were four keys. I wish I could see what's inside. It's not the time for that. What happened to the Guardians? They disappeared little by little. Very few people understood their work. It is sad. In my opinion, this world runs on the cooperation between people. Can you see the spiral on the door? Although they seem to be separated dots, everything is connected by the spiral. The wind of Mara. It is true. Like when you ask me for stuff and I help you. Yes. Even though you're always grumbling. Well, I would rather do nothing. Don't you like lying on the grass? Of course, who doesn't? But being responsible is very important. When one of those dots disappears, everything collapses. Koa, you must help others, always. How? By bringing them something they need, or planting a seed. Every action, as small as they may be, can be beneficial to others. Do we have to help everyone? Even if they are mean? There are mean people that are lost and need help. But there are other people that are truly mean. How will I tell the difference? You'll know by looking them in the eye. Inviting them out to eat. You say that a lot, yeah, yeah. You have to win their hearts with food. That's it, Koya. Don't forget it. Time to go to bed. Alright, the day passed so quickly. Good night, little guardian. Go back home and sleep. I will! I'm exhausted. I made an axe, I made a fish. Ingrod, I caught fish. Made a horrible dinner that was literally just fish and carrots in a bowl. Actually, I, I could eat fish and carrots if it was good fish. Oh, wow. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> A sign of things to come, perhaps? Really love the fact that we've got sort of proper drawn uh, cutscenes and stuff. Have we grown up a little bit? Uh-oh. So, so what? So what? Nothing. Not a single pirate ship in sight. Oh. Now I'm starving to death. I'm going to make some berry juice for breakfast. I hope they're ready for harvest. Collect some berries from the wild bushes to make some juice. I will! 
We, have we got bigger? I feel like we've ta we're taller. I feel like we're taller. So berries, berry bushes. Are these berry bushes? No, they're more, they're more like uh, just nice looking plants. They're not berry bushes. That's like weeds and stuff. Uh, berry bushes then. Let's have a look. Berry bushes, eh? Berry bushes, you'll say. There we go, fish. Where's all the berry bushes? Oh. oh. Hit. Oh, there we go. So that you can actually just see the berries on them, right? Oh, you used to say... Uh, this is a stable for sheep. Well, I've never seen one. So maybe in the future we'll have sheep. So it is these bushes, but we've got to actually see whether there's fruit on them. There's some. There's some more. I'll take that. I have enough. I'm going to... Plant produce. Mash him up. I don't think there's any harm in keeping them. I can't imagine they'd go off or anything like that. So we'll take a few more. Uh, kitchen. Black reduce. I noticed that we're only speaking about the lady, the old lady in uh, past tense now. I should plant the fields. I'll take a nap. No wait. I must prepare the fields and plant and harvest. Oof, work is exhausting. Oh, there we go. Carrot seeds. And we can now make better fish. That's good. So, let's hoe up. Uh, carrot seeds. Oh, we got loads of carrot seeds. I'm, I'm quite happy to do a lot. Now, I wonder if we're going to need some things to, to get rid of this stone and stuff. should build a new well. I would need a hammer to do it. Maybe I can gather the materials if I destroy the old room well and the axe. I don't remember where I put my last hammer. Maybe I can make a new one. Okay. Use the hammer to destroy the old well and gather the materials to make a hammer at the workshop. Okay. Is that all we were doing? So a hammer will break those down. Okay, cool. Well, let's get some more. I know it said just do two. But I can't see there's any harm with planting some more carrots. And we can we can get the four like this. Okay. And there we'll break down the old ruined well. So we got two bits of metal from that. Let's have a look. Metal hammer. We, we're good to go. We can make it. Good. Beautiful for building and smashing stones to collect materials. But I need something else. Oh, now I know. A bucket. I have to make a bucket. As Okay, we're going to make a bucket. Make a bucket. And uh, we can make a fence. And we can make a chicken coop. And we can make some rope. My goodness, that was a bit of a big hit, wasn't it? Uh, so what's the, what's the bucket? There we go. Bucket is just two wood. So making the bucket, what was it that Yaya said? A well is a very simple thing, a hole in the ground, wooden stone. It doesn't seem that simple to me. I'll have to cut some trees down. With the hammer, I'll be able to break the stones in the cave. They're pretty handy. So now we can build a well. Use the hammer to build a well near the crops. Okay, so is the hammer going to be an actual tool now? I see. So the hammer is like this, and we can build a well. We need a few more stone, and we need some wood. And hopefully we'll get metal from there as well. So... I think the hammer is... I need a better hammer. Okay. So we need a better hammer to break the stone that's in the farm. But I'm hoping this hammer will break this stuff. Okay. So we got some stone. We got some... 
metal and something else as well. What's that other one that we're picking up? Uh, stone, raw copper, and just some metal as well. Okay, that's good. Well, I'm assuming these are going to grow back over a bit of time. It's definitely a start, though. And we do have a, an energy bar now as well, look. That's going down as we do this stuff. So I assume that's filled up by perhaps food, or, or maybe it's more like a Stardew Valley thing, like that's the end of the day when your energy's all used up. Okay, that looks like a chicken coop, doesn't it? Looks like it used to be, yeah. So, we can build the well, I think, wherever we like, but we now have... Oh, no, we need some wood. Okay, where's our axe? I don't want to chop down the orange trees. So, instead, we will chop down these pines and maybe get some seeds. That looks like a seed. There we go. We want to get the seeds, don't we? Because we want... We want more trees eventually. Oh yeah, there we go. There's another one dropped down there as well. Okay. We'll take that one. Uh, we'll do one more. I think we need like eight. Curry's exhausted. She needs to rest to get her energy back. Well, that's fine. So is that... Are we calling that an end, the end of the day then? Okay, let's, uh, we can have 30 on the island, is that telling me there? It's kind of annoying that I have to do this every time, 23 out of 30, yeah, looks like, looks like that's what we need. I know, are you, is that it, is that it, that's, that's the end of the day. <laughs> Exhausted. So it's 8.39 in the morning. Can we... And we haven't got much energy. I'm assuming that's because we passed out. Can we sleep? Will that refill it? 8.34. We're fully energized, but we are hungry. So we can eat some... Eat. That gives us one of those back. And maybe a carrot. A carrot gives us half a one. So we're probably better off making food, I guess. But otherwise, that's okay. So, do we now have everything we need for a well, 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 well? Well, well, well. Oh, we need one more piece of wood. Oh, the trees are growing already. That's good. That means they grow pretty quick. So, we'll cut one more down. And that should give us the, the wood we need for a well. Hole in the ground, stone and wood. And I feel like this is probably the sensible spot for it, right? Where it was anyway. Maybe here. So it's a little bit out of the way of whatever is going to go there. I don't know what that's meant to be. Let's do build a well. Okay, so it can. it's pretty free form. That's nice. But let's just put it here then. And you and always rotate. Oh, wow, that's pretty good. <laughs> Thank you, Mountain. Thank you, Tree. I hope you like this well I made. Now, let's water everything. It's my favorite part. Oh, take water. There we go. A lot of work, but it's worth it. I wonder if there are other islands like mine. I wish I could visit them. The fountain provides no fuel now, and the boat is still broken. Never mind, I'll go to the beach and collect the seashells gifted to me by the tides of Mara. Oh, this is, yeah, like time has passed. This is... So we've got three water a day. I'm hoping that's three water a day. Okay. We'll go and get some shells, and then I think we'll leave it there. This is pretty much episode one. I, again, I'm, I'm pretty sure this might suit itself better to a live stream. I think this would be fun to play along with you folks on our daily live streams. And and now the um what are you? Oh, I just got some crawfish or something. That's cool. Um and now that sort of Animal Crossing is is easing up a little, like there's not so much to do every day. It might be nice to sort of intersperse this and Animal Crossing. I think these sort of chilled out life simmy type games work really well for live streams. Uh, oh, there's different kinds of fish there. Okay. 
I don't have the bait. That's interesting. There's a fish spot. Um, yeah, awesome. I, I'd really like to know whether you're enjoying this one. Pop it down in the comments if you are. Thanks very much for watching. Until the next one, be good.